So it's Shibi from carrypad.com at the Intel Boost CS2012. We're taking a look at a Medfield based tablet. This is actually the Lenovo Idea Tab, which is, uh, as far as I know, is just pretty much unannounced right now. But uh, here it is uh, on the demo booth, um, really under pre production label here. So we've got um, Intel Medfield in, inside. It's a 1.6 gigahertz uh, single core hyper threading uh, system with hardware video acceleration, hardware uh, video uh, encoding, I believe, as well, and a bunch of other uh, Intel goodies in there. GMA 600, I think, is the uh, is the graphics subsystem in there as well. So here we're running uh, ice cream sandwich, right? This is a uh, what screen resolution is this? 1280 by? Uh, we say it's about 13 by 7. Oh, right. Okay, what's the resolution of the screen? Oh, this can this is capable of driving video at 1080. All right, but you don't know the actual screen resolution. The actual of this screen one. resolution, I couldn't tell you. Right, about okay. This Looks pretty good though. It's pretty uh, sharp screen, yeah, yeah. and it's a fairly nice viewing angle all around. So that's almost uh, sort of IPS quality uh, display, which is really nice. Um, just have a quick look around the device. This is the power. There's a U micro USB here, and we've got a micro HDMI. There as well. I think that's pretty much it for around the device, isn't it? Oh, we got. Is that a SIM card slot? It is. It's a SIM card slot, so 3G capable tablet. Sorry, this which slot? This is an SD. This is an SD, but there's another. Yeah, this would be for the SIM card. Right. So there's possibly a 3G version of this coming as well. On the top, going around there, we can see volume rocker and power switch. And on the back, have we got? Um, oh, we've got something else on this side. Yep. There's the headphone port. We were missing that. And um, probably one of the speaker outputs there, I guess. And you want at the back? And the back, we've got a camera with an LED flash. And it's quite a nice sort of rubberized uh, finish. I'm not sure if this will be the final design. It'll, possibly it'll change a little bit. <laughs> possibly not. Yeah, yeah. So ice cream sandwich uh, is what it's going to be delivered with. And um, can you do? Have you got any demos here you can yeah, show yeah, us? Sure. So you know we're very excited about the progress we've been making with Android. As you may know, at you know IDF last September, which was five months ago, we announced more deep uh, involvement with Google. Optimized honeycomb that you see there. Ice cream sandwich came up very quickly. We've been optimizing this as pre-production, of course, but most of the 400,000 apps that are available on Android will work out of the box on IA. The mostly Dalvik apps. Some native apps to leverage unique Intel features will require some work, but we've got a native development kit available on the Android portal for developers to leverage that. Um, you know, as far as basic performance goes, we're we're in good shape. One app that I like to show from a graphic standpoint is uh, yeah. there we go. Is the app called Body? So this one, this one basically shows you the human body. You know, so you can see it's pretty fast and smooth there. Right. Um, you know, this is if you want to zoom in and take a look at you know oh, muscles wow. around the face. Yeah. You know, if you prefer skeletons, you can look at skeletons. So this is just a taste of what's to come. You know, if you like games, we've also yeah. got some games here. So you know, cut the rope. This you probably saw the demo yesterday. But um, <laughs> that's all you're gonna say. You know, that's all so basically. <laughs> Yeah. I'm not very good at the game, but you can see that you can do something here. So, sure, sure. so you know, the point here is that we've spent some time taking what you'd expect in terms of performance from Intel, packing that into a desirable power profile. So this is an 8.9 millimeter thick tablet with additional enhancements to come. Right. Battery life, we expect you know 10 plus hours, or let's call it all day in terms of usage, yep. and 30 days standby. So yeah, this so is what customers are looking for with traditional Intel performance. The graphics that I showed you yep. and then to add to that we're adding features so wireless display is an example right you know you're familiar with our core yes. PC shipping with that this platform is also going to be wide eye capable right we made some announcements on our wide eye booth for the receiver oh. side for Samsung and LG TVs will have wide eye technology built in so yep. you can receive you know kind of a display from this so we'll be effectively pushing the screens up onto our that's big right. displays which should be uh, that's that's right. and the audio as well that's that right. in mind as well so, so, so we're very nice excited value. about that. It's a very low latency, you know, secure solution. Yeah. Um, and we expect 2012 to be a big year. Yeah. Great. Okay. Thanks for that. It's the Lenovo Idea Tab. Uh, running on Medfield Ice Cream Sandwich software here at the Intel CS 2012.